So the next thing we're done with the videos, then we have our quick shot. And quick shot, we have uh, a new one actually in here. If you're new to the, the Mini 2 and you're coming from the Mini, we have the boomerang and the boomerang wasn't there before. And uh, so we have the drony, the rocket, the circle, the helix and the boomerang. So let's take a look at all of these. Now the drony, you can see it's gonna look at you and then it's gonna fly back at a distance climbing at the same time. So the, the final distance, the, 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 the number here is the distance away from you that it's gonna be. Now I'm gonna use only 80 feet because I'm somewhat limited in, in uh, distance here, but uh, I'm gonna turn this around and then kind of face it towards me as I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I can get away from this window, by the way. I'm just gonna tap right here and you can see there's a start. It says start. Now here I am I'm sitting on that beautiful rock right here and, um, and then you see there's a little plus button. So if I actually tap on the plus button, I recognize that there's someone on this image. So I'm gonna tap on that. And uh, here I am, I'm selected. Now if I start moving, then this would actually kind of follow me around. Uh, but then I'm gonna push start. And then guess what? It's just gonna do its thing. Three seconds, two seconds, and then it's gonna start climbing back. Now I'm gonna keep my fingers on the, uh, on the control right here as it does this. But see, now it's flying back all by itself. Uh, again, I'm making sure that no one is around um, and I have my thumbs on the control. I can also push cancel at any time to cancel that. So uh, if you touch the controls, then it's going to stop on its own. And then when it's done, it's uh, returning back to its original spot right here. So coming back and then um, that's it. Then we can actually review the footage. So it's now it's done and uh, we can review the footage by pushing the, the review button right here. This. And then there it is. Here's the footage that we did. And, uh, and here's the footage in itself. Okay. The next one, I'm going to tap again on that icon and then we're going to go to rocket. So rocket kind of goes right on top of us and then is going to be flying. Now, you need to make sure that you are the operator or somebody in your operation is uh, underneath the drone because you can't really fly over people unless they're part of the operation. And then this is the different altitude. Again, I'm gonna keep it at 80 feet so it goes a little bit quicker. Now I'm gonna move forward a little bit because I don't wanna do it right on top of me right here. So I'm just gonna move forward and uh, I'm gonna get out of this window. So here I am right here. So we'll do the drone from right here and then I'm gonna stay push the plus button and as I push the plus button I'm going to start see what it does put the recorder in my pocket there it goes so now it's actually not flying on top of me at the moment um, it's just kind of flying straight up it just went straight up this is cool very long shadow uh, because the sun is a little down this is uh, Beautiful fall shadows right here. And then it's coming back. So it did its thing, it climbed up, and then it's gonna come back and get to the point where it started, which is right here, perfect. And then, there you go, it returned. So let's take a look at what this actually did. This, you can see the icon in the bottom left corner, and we're just gonna play it, see what happens, there it is. Okay, so here's the footage. I'll play the full footage in the actual video so you can see what that final product looks like. Now let's do the next one. The next one is our circle. And our circle is gonna be, I'm gonna go a little bit further in here um, and just have the drone kind of follow me. Now I wanna make sure there's no golfers. I'm not bothering anyone. And I'm just gonna kind of stand in the middle of the field right here. And you can already see two things. You can see an arrow. There's an arrow. Uh, I'm gonna climb so that I can get out of the trees even though there's not really a whole lot of anything around right here. And um, you can see right here that I have a, a direction. I can go left, I can go right. Now it's not really picking me right now in the middle. So I'm gonna get closer and see if I can do. Yeah, there you go. See, now it's picking me up in the middle here. It had a little issue at first. Now I can go clockwise or counterclockwise. Uh, I'm just gonna go into the clockwise direction. I'm just gonna push start and see what it does. So it's just gonna kinda go around us. Again, kinda have my fingers on the control just in case just looking around, making sure everything is good. And then it's just gonna go all the way around us. Keeping an eye again on everything. 
Now in this case, you can't really change the speed. Now on some of the DJI drones, you can actually change the speed. Not a whole lot of settings here. This is very simple uh, controls and that's it. And it's done. And we can do it in the opposite direction as well. So, so that's, uh, that's our circle. The helix is going to do kind of a, like a shell if you want. It's kind of like a, an orbit but with some climbing as well. I'm going to keep it at 80 feet, uh, the radius. Actually, I'm going to keep it a little bit tighter, 60 feet radius. Let's see what it actually does right here. So first I have to pick a, uh, a subject. Yeah, there you go. You have to make sure you get that little plus sign on the screen, otherwise it's not going to let you do it. So uh, I'm going to get a little bit closer. It's having issues. There you go, picking me up. Now I have that circle. So let's start. Let's see what it does. Now it's flying at uh, 22 feet elevation right now. It's uh, 63 feet away from me. So it's going to go around and then what it's going to do is you can see the distance away from me now. Uh, actually that's the distance from takeoff so that's not really a good example. I apologize. Uh, but the height is staying the same. The height is increasing a little bit now. And it's going to do like an oval going all the way around me. and. Uh, climbing at the same time at a higher altitude so now it's definitely much further away than it was when i started when i started it was kind of right on top of me and uh like only a, a like a dozen feet away from me and then as it ends it's higher and further away from me and then now it's coming back and um there you go now you can see the difference As far as the boomerang, you need a little bit more room for the boomerang. So I'm going to set it up right here so it's right next to us uh, because it's going to do a much bigger circle. And there's really uh, no way to change the altitude on this one. So what we're going to do is, uh, you can hear the wind probably a little bit here. I'm going to find myself right here. And you can see that it shows you the actual uh, lo the location, the way that it's going to turn. And see as I go up actually the camera follows me which is really cool. So let's try this, let's start it and then I'm gonna have my finger on the pause button just in case uh, we get a little bit too close to the trees. Uh, there it is right here. Okay, so it's going to do kind of an ellipse around us following us as it's climbing higher and higher. come back and much closer to me now. So it's kind of like a potato circle if you want. And uh, there it is, coming back. So that's it. That's You can do it in the opposite direction also if you wanted. And you can also review what that actually looked like. So let's take a look. Thank you.